based on the perspective of a heat generator we got a different concept of Peltier effect In 1834, a French scientist Peltier discovered the concept of Peltier effect. An effect whereby heat is given out or absorbed when an electrical current is passed across a junction between two materials. So, the electric current is passed through a circuit consisting of two dissimilar metals. Heat is evolved at one junction and heat is absorbed at another junction. This is referred to as Peltier effect and it's a converse of Seebeck effect. You are able to see the current is passed between the two dissimilar metals. The heat is absorbed and it is sent out. It's evolved. In a copper and iron thermocouple, at the junction J1, where the current flows from copper to iron, so it is absorbed, so it gets cooled here. At junction 2, where the current flows from iron to copper, it is liberated. When the direction of the current is reversed, at junction 1, it gets heated and junction 2, it's cooled. It indicates the Peltier effect is reversible. The amount of heat energy absorbed or able at one of the junction of a thermocouple when one ampere of current flows for one second. And this is referred to as a Peltier coefficient. And it is denoted by the symbol pi and its unit is volt. So H is the heat generated is directly proportional to the current and time. The Peltier coefficient is the junction. It's nothing but the Peltier electromotive force at the junction. The Peltier coefficient depends on the pair of metals in contact and the temperature of the junction.